This is one of multiple OSPF troubleshooting videos. In this scenario, we've been told that router 1 is not able to ping router 4. So let's test that. Can router 1 ping the loopback of router 4? Answer is no. Show IP route. We are receiving OSPF routes, so we're receiving a route for the loopback of router 2. We're receiving a route for network 10120, but we're not receiving other routes. Show IP OSPF neighbor confirms that we have a neighbor relationship to router 2. So as an example, we can ping the loopback of router 2. I'll disable IP domain lookup to make trace route complete quicker. And let's see if we can trace to router 4. The trace in this example will not leave the local router because we don't have a gateway of last resort and we don't have a specific route to quadruple four. So the trace is simply dropped at the local router. Now what about router two? Show IP OSPF neighbor. Router two has a neighbor relationship to router one, but doesn't have a neighbor relationship to router three. Can router two ping router three? Yes, it can. So it doesn't look like it's an IP connectivity problem. It looks like it's something else. Can router 3 ping router 2? Yes, it can. Show IP OSPF neighbor. Router 3 has a neighbor relationship to router 4, but not to router 2. So we definitely have a problem between router 2 and router 3. So on router 2, show IP OSPF interface brief. OSPF is enabled on gigabit 00. zero and gigabit 01 shows CDP neighbors, shows us that router three is connected to gigabit 01. So OSPF is enabled on that interface. The local router is a designated router. Back on router three, show IP OSPF interface brief. OSPF is enabled on gigabit 00 and gigabit 01 we can see that router 2 is connected to gigabit 01. So OSPF is enabled on this interface and the local router believes that it's the designated router. So we have two routers on the same segment thinking that they are the designated routers. Let's have a look at the interface without brief. So show IP OSPF interface gigabit 01. We can see the IP address of the router. The area is area zero. Router ID is this. Network type is broadcast, cost is one. There's no backup designated router on the segment. We can see the hello and other timers. We can see a lot of other information here. What about on this side? So show IP OSPF interface gigabit zero one. Can you spot the problem? What's the problem between router two and router three? Here's router two, here's router three. What's the problem? Okay, look at the timers. For OSPF to form neighbor relationships, the timers must be the same. The hollow timer on router three is 30 seconds, whereas it's 10 seconds on router two. Dead interval on this side is 40, this side it's 120. Weight is 40, 120, retransmit is five and five. Also have a look at the network type. That's a broadcast, this is a non-broadcast. If you want OSPF routers to form a neighbor relationship, the timers need to be the same. Timers can be influenced by the network command. Ethernet is a broadcast, multi-access environment, not a non-broadcast environment. That would be used for frame relay as an example. So we need to set the OSPF network type to broadcast. And notice as soon as I've done that, neighbor relationships are formed. If you look at the timers, notice the timers here are now the same as router two. Timers are set the same. 
show IP OSPF neighbors, we have two neighbor relationships. So back on router one, is router one able to trace to quadruple four? Yes, it is, so that looks a lot better. So we can ping quadruple four as an example. That was an OSPF troubleshooting scenario. Make sure that your timers are the same. Check your network types in OSPF. It's important that the OSPF network types be the same for CCNA. There are some weird and wonderful implementations that you can have with OSPF, but that's not important for CCNA. Check your network types, check your timers, ensure that they're the same between routers. I hope you enjoyed this video. If it was of benefit to you, please like it and please subscribe to my YouTube channel. I wish you all the very best.